Hey guys, it's Ray. Sorry I haven't posted a video in the past few days, but I do have some very exciting news. I got my new laptop um, and I'm so excited because I have been playing The Sims a little bit and it's just like so much smoother. The quality is so much better and like I can actually do a face cam now. Um, so uh, just a warning, most of this video might be me freaking out about how good the graphics are. Um, so you have been warned. Uh, but before we start today's episode, so don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you are notified when I post a new video. So let's begin today's episode. So we're going to do a few things in today's episode. First, we are going to, well, we have to wait for Princess Lindsay to have her baby because she should be having her very soon. Um, or I don't know, he, her, I don't know if it's a boy or a girl. Uh, but while we do that, I had a request for you guys to see the Ward household, which is uh, Princess Cora's ex-boyfriend, Sir Javin, and his new girlfriend. I guess they're married now, um, but they have twins. So they said that they wanted to see that um, household. So I guess we'll just have our Sims travel to their house because I think think they know them. Maybe they don't, but um, of course the king and queen or future king and queen want to get to know like as many people in the kingdom as possible. And although the ward household isn't like politically important, she's still famous. Uh, so they definitely want to meet her. So we're going to go ahead and travel to their house. So we're just going to go ahead and travel with them. So why don't we, oh, let's see, where do they live again? They live in Del Sol Valley. So we're going to go meet them. Um, and I don't think, oh, did I, did I say yes? Yeah. Let's travel. Okay, so it will be Lady Lindsay, and let's just go with Prince Adrian. Um, so yeah, we can just go with them. Okay, so we are at the Ward Den. Oh no! Oh! Shoot! Because it's celebrity... Oh, okay, good. Alright, awesome. Prince Aiden... Aiden... Adrian... Adri oh my gosh. Prince Adrian can go in. So he's going to go ahead and knock on the door, because I think he knows Judith Ward, or at least he knows Sir Javin, I'm pretty sure. I don't think I've ever actually seen this. No, I have seen this house, I think, because when I was slightly playing with Sir Javin and Judith for a bit. So um, this is their house. It's very pretty. Honestly, I think this like, this is probably more of Princess Anna's style. Cause if you guys saw the last episode, Princess Anna lives next door. Um, so her style would probably be more similar to this, I would think, but Maybe she can like take Judas home. Maybe they can swap. Maybe they can do a house swap. Okay, Diego is very hungry. All right, that's their son. Oh, and Malcolm. Oh, okay, so they have twins. So they have twin boys um, who I think we're just gonna go at. Oh, wow, look how they like construct. Oh, okay, they kind of misplaced them a little bit, but I was like, wow, the game like actually placed them symmetrically and like with style. That never happens, um, but it looks like they messed up a little bit. It doesn't look like anyone would ever actually be able to get to this bed with those bassinets. Uh, but we're going to just go ahead and age up their kids because I'm pretty sure it's time for them to age up anyway. They've had the babies for a while. Um, so I guess they have they have twins. So they have Diego and Malcolm. Uh, oh, I totally missed that. Oh my gosh, guys, this game is so like, it's so smooth now. Usually there's a lag or something. So I cannot believe how fast that just was. I totally missed it. Okay. And then we'll age up. So who is this? This is Malcolm. And then we'll age up uh, Diego Ward. I guess they took their mother's last name. Uh, yeah, they're not like, they wouldn't be considered royal. Oh my gosh. Did he already? That was just, that was like a second. That took no time at all. Um, yeah, but I, they wouldn't be like counting as a noble just because their father's a noble um just because he moved to like another kingdom or another world so this isn't like a prestigious household or anything like that but maybe this family could qualify for like the prime minister so you never know um yeah because sir javin is not a noble like he's not going to inherit any title anymore he kind of gave that up to his sister so he could marry judith um so oh my gosh judith is making him sleep in this like pink bedroom well i guess it's sometimes blue all right so we're going to wake up judith ford and sir javin just so we could talk to them because it's like they have company so they might as well talk to us okay well i don't know why i had lady Lindsay wake them up too she should be having her baby soon i don't know why 
Oh, oh, okay, gone into labor. All right, well, we have to go take Lady Lindsay to the hospital then. But I hope you guys are, like, happy. I know this was, like, very short, but at least you guys kind of got to see a little bit of, like, their house and, like, their two boys that they have now. So, uh, yeah, so this is their house. It's a beautiful home. Like, I love this. I wish it had, like, a little bit more. Like, it's also very spacious, but... I really love this house. I kind of just want it to be Princess Anna's really badly. And I love like the land that it's on too. I mean, look at this. They have like the balcony, I guess a balcony, like reaching out over the heels. Queen Isabel's spirit is fading. Oh no. <gasps> okay, we have to go straighten that connection like really, really badly. Okay, yeah, I just want to like take a look at the view again, like the nighttime view because I've seen it during the day, but I haven't seen it at night. It looks a little blurry. I don't know why. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh man, this is awesome. Is there a moon? There is a moon. Oh, this is the coolest. Okay. All right. So we have to take Lady Lindsay to, the, or not Lady Lindsay. We have to take Princess Lindsay or Princess Lynn to the hospital. So we're going to, she's using the restroom, but we're going to go ahead and take her to the hospital. Um, and we will have Prince Adrian come along with her. So yes, join Prince Adrian will come with her and we will go have our baby. Okay, so we are at the Willow Creek Hospital with Lady Lindsay. I brought, I tried to bring Prince Adrian. Oh, I can bring him here. Okay, good. Yeah, I thought I did. Why? I don't know why it won't let me. Huh. It's been doing that, I think, since I got my new computer. So hopefully that's not like a reoccurring thing, but it might be. So, all right, I have no idea where Lady Lindsay or Princess Liz, oh my gosh. Princess Lindsay. I don't know where she's going. Looks like she's going to go wash her hands, but she needs to have her baby. So let's see. What is she? Is she checking in? She's cleaning. No, check into the hospital. What are you doing? Um, why don't we check in? Friend, no, pig selfie. No, friendly. Friendly. Why can't I check in? I just want to check her in. That's all we want to do. Why? What? No, have your baby here. You are very uncomfortable. You should be having your baby. What is happening? Use, have baby at hospital. Yeah. Yes, join. No, just, just, okay, we'll try to bring Prince Adrian here. But just go. Okay, okay, good, that worked. Okay, so she's changed into her patient outfit. Um, and it looks like she's walking over to the, um, Whatchamajigger, that thing, the the baby delivery machine, I guess, even though it's definitely not a baby delivery machine because it like takes out your heart and squirts like liquid everywhere. And like, I don't know, it just looks scary. Okay, so this is, I recognize this doctor. Please be a doctor, not an intern. He's a doctor. Okay, good. Yeah, I totally recognize that doctor. I'm pretty sure he's delivered like almost all of the royal babies that we've been to the hospital for. So Hopefully he does a good job with this one. I'm excited to see what we're gonna have. It looks like we're about to see. <gasps> okay, so we had a baby boy. So I promised one of our viewers that I would name the baby after them. Um, so I know that their name is, Pr is Francisco. Um, the only thing is, oh, Francis. Um, the only thing is that the name is just a little bit long for us, unfortunately, um, for us to fit it in here. Um, so I'm going to do with Prince Francis for not for now, but we know that it is Prince Francisco. Um, so when he becomes king, because he is go supposed to be king, um, he's the heir to the throne. So when he becomes king, then it will be King Francisco. Um, so yeah, so we're going to do uh, Prince Francis for right now. So we have our baby boy. I'm excited. Um, I don't know. Do you guys think that they should try for another baby? Because we already have like a lot of babies. Like we have three in the Willow Creek household, three in the Windenburg household. We have two in the um, Brindleton Bay household. So let me know what you guys think. If you think that they should have more because... I think two might be enough, especially since, oh God, that baby's crying. Um, especially since the two are already in the, um, no, I'm sorry. Especially since the king and queen are still in the household, um, they're still alive. So we have a lot of Sims in this house. Um, so yeah, just let me know what you guys think. So the next thing we're gonna do, so we have our baby, we have a Prince Francis. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and check 
back on Princess Anna because she is still like I haven't touched her since um, we played with her for the acting career. Um, so where does she live? Oh, she lives in Del Sol Valley. Um, so I think we're going to have her. Oh, you know what? Or maybe, maybe we should just have our Windenburg royal family visit her. Oh, what am I doing? I'm traveling. I want to go to Manage Worlds. Um, oh, yep. Okay. So we're going to go to Manage Worlds. Um, so yes, we're going to go ahead and have our royal family of Windenburg go visit Princess Anna. And we're probably going to bring Princess Cora with us. Um, but yeah, just because of like they want to see the house too. Okay. Oh, guys, I cannot believe how smooth everything is running. Like, I'm not used to this. This is amazing. I'm so happy right now. This is awesome, guys. Oh, my gosh. Okay. All right. So we want us to travel. Okay. So we're going to go and bring everyone to uh, Princess Anna's new place. And I still wish she had um, the ward's new house. Maybe I'll like update it and like download something from the gallery or something. But so we want to bring Princess Cora. We want to bring Queen Alice. Um, and we want to bring all of the kids along too. So Princess Amira, Prince Kellen, and Princess May. Um, so we'll bring them all. And oh my gosh, they're so cute. I can't wait to like see them again. I haven't played this in like the past few days. So I'm so excited. Okay. So we are at Princess Anna's house, which is Chateau Peak. Um, and oh my gosh, just look how cute our kids are. Oh, I did not realize that Prince Kellen is wearing the same overalls as Princess May, so I should probably change that. I was just trying to find something purple, but okay. So we are going to knock on her door. Gosh, she has so much land. Like, oh my goodness. The house is so small compared to the rest of the land and everything. But it looks so good. Oh, and I love that, like, the front door, you have to, like, go up the stairs to go there. That's kind of cool. And she has two bulls. Oh, God, that's so cool. Yeah, I, this, I don't know. It's so contemporary and, like, just all really dark. It just doesn't seem like Princess Anna to me. Um, so we'll definitely have to have to update a little bit. Okay, so Princess Anna is watching TV on her giant TV. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. <gasps> It looks so good. It looks amazing. Okay. Offer gratitude to Princess Anna. Yes. We'll do that. Heartfelt compliment. Can the kids all come up the stairs too and talk to their aunt? I think most of them have a good relationship. Diaper, please. Um, we'll do babbling. Princess May can also babble. Um, we can have Prince Kellen. He can hug her lovingly. Everyone is just, oh, they're so happy for her. I'm so excited, guys. I love Princess Alice's warm weather outfit, too. I'm pretty sure. I don't know if you guys have seen this yet. Oh, whoa, what happened? Um, but yeah, I love that. I love the purple. And okay, so we are having all the, oh, no, 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 wait. Princess May doesn't have any clothes on. <laughs> okay, Queen Alice, please change your daughter. Um... Put some clothes on her. Can I do that? Toddler care, change outfit. Yes, please. All right, just change her into her, her everyday outfit. And where's Prince Kellen? He is way behind the back. He is, oh, he's the youngest. He's so cute. He's just like, wait for me. Oh my God, he's adorable. I love him. He looks so much like his mother. It's crazy. Oh, this is so cute. This is adorable. Okay, all right. I still cannot get over, like, how smoothly this is running. Who's he talking to? <gasps> what is happening? Did you guys see that? His arms went, like, behind his head like that. Oh, okay. All right. Why is Princess May still naked? Queen Alice is supposed to change her outfit. All right, she's doing that now. I don't know where Princess Cora went. We invited her to come. <gasps> no. Oh, there's Princess Cora. Oh, my gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Prince Kellen. Oh, he made a mess in front of his aunt's house. No, stop. <gasps> stop. No. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Discipline, recent behavior. Firm. Express disappointment for making a mess. No. Where does he even get this stuff? What is that? It's like flour and soy sauce? Chocolate? I don't know. 
Um, all right. So we need to discipline him for making a huge mess and then clean it up. We don't have any like children, like besides toddlers to clean it up because usually I'll make the children or the teenagers clean it up because then they get like the responsibility points for it. All right. Princess Amira has reached a movement level. Oh my gosh. Prince Kellen, stop. No, Queen Alice, you are supposed to discipline him. What are you doing? Whoa. Okay. Stop. What are you doing? Stop it. Oh my gosh. All right. We'll just have to discipline him later. Um, but yeah, so we have visited Princess Alice, or sorry, not Princess Alice. We've visited um, Princess Anna, and it looks like she's doing well. So we're definitely happy for her. So I'm actually going to stop this video here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And we will see you guys in the next episode.